cut again, you guys. Rub your hands. <laughs> it's so cold here. It's only 82 now. <laughs> Well, good afternoon. It is now another day and another location. I am at Busland. We have Alexander on barbecue duty. All right, happy, check it out. happy Canada Day. We got some ribs, popper. Oh, look at the poppers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Alexander. Uh, she's eating it. And it's Ember's it's Ember's first watermelon. watermelon. Day. Happy Canada Day. Oh, do you like Wait. it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. Indeed. <laughs> Look at this spread. Damn. Look at this. It's Sound. Canada Day. <laughs> to the moon, to the moon, yeah, to the moon. Rocking herself to sleep. Lulling herself to sleep. Okay, it's another work day in Busland. Jaylene is working on her door. Isaac is, what are you doing there, buddy? You're trimming. I don't know what I'm doing. We're trimming. Honestly the new curtain rod that Alexander is going to install. What are you doing back here, Alexander? He's trimming, he's installing some trim for Peach. Okay, yeah. So it's just a work day. So taking, taking my tools back to my car. Oh, who's in bed? Oh, good morning, my darling. Yeah, are you in bed? Okay. So I'll show you what I do. I've got this curtain rod here, but I'm installing this one along the ceiling and it's gonna be shaved. So it's gonna slip in here and this is gonna run along the ceiling. And then they have these little curtain pulleys. You'll see when it's all together. I've got a van life kitten. Oh, hello. Okay. Are you really, really wanna be here, don't you? Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, so we're trimming off the edges. And then we sand it down to smooth it out. It's a proper tool. Tin snips, yes, to do this. Oh, easy, like butter, right? Just right through it. Excellent. So tin snips, box cutter knife, and a pair of pliers are really the three tools you would need to do this. Okay, so I'm going to blue bucket laundry the curtains and we'll give them a little wash here before I install them. Okay, so the curtains are at the dry cleaners today, Blue Bucket Laundry. Alexander's got the piece ready here. We're going to see if it actually fits. Blue Bucket Laundry's almost done. <laughs> We're gonna have a chai tea break over here. So whenever you're doing a project, you know, I thought, oh, I'm just gonna take this stuff out of the bag, put the curtain up in the element real easy. No. Okay, and then over here, that's where I'm hanging the curtains to dry and then I'll be trimming them so that they'll be much better inside the element. But let's see if the water's boiling. Okay. Oh yeah, water's boiling. Little chai tea break. It's nice to take tea breaks when you're working. I'm so grateful for Alexander and Isaac and Jaylena and just being able to have a place to touch down and just work on work on my vehicle. It's very nice to be able to have a place to come to with all the tools to fix my rig. A little sweet cream for the tea. One for Alexander and one for me. 
So here is the string that I tied to my roof rack and then ran it through to the other side. So Alexander's got this piece. So we slip it up into here. Oh, and it's nice and tight. Okay, I'm gonna get you to hold the camera and film me. Okay. And then so. New YouTuber here. And then, oh, Alexander, this is gonna fit perfect. What? Oh, I think this is it. Oh, I think there this is go. it. Oh, that's, that's it. it. That's it. And then I'll just be. Oh, it's perfect. It's perfect. Oh, it worked. Okay, we'll come back and show you how I hang the curtains. So the last part of the installation are these little rollers. This is the track that goes onto onto here okay and then when this is inserted these roll back and forth on the track for me to open and close my curtain so that's what I'm gonna do next is just install some of these <laughs> here stop do it right okay don't f it up <laughs> Jeez. All right. Okay, so all of these are. This is the girly part. I'm not doing that. This is the girly part. <laughs> he did the manly part, and now I'm doing the lady bits. <laughs> oh my goodness. Beautiful job. Thank you so much for helping me. Alexander shares well. Fabrication. And does fabrication. <laughs> Got another product from one of our sponsors. Alexander is going to go through it. He's at it again. He's at it again. <laughs> He's building again. So it comes with the user's manual. You know, you want to read it before you have a fire, especially if you're not used to having fires. And they, uh, they put letters on. Yeah, so everything, this is, that's this the is top. A. a, and that's this is B. D? D? Yeah, that's D. 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 Yeah, D. Mm hmm. And this is stainless steel. Right, here's the heavy piece. Yeah, that's the heavy piece. This is the yeah. unboxing. That's F. <laughs> this is the guy thing again, where it doesn't <laughs> read the directions. He just starts monkeying around. <laughs> I do that too, so it's not a guy yeah. thing. Ladies do it too. Okay, good to know. Yeah, no, because I, <laughs> I'm right there with you. I'm like, yeah, just rip it apart. Don't take that off. Yeah, rip right. it. <laughs> Do you think that comes out? It does look like. We'll see that let's see in here. Let's just, see. Uh, yeah, it looks like it might come out. Oh, there we go. Okay, yeah, he was right. Just the plastic, I think, made it taut. Mm -hmm. So that one goes in there first. Look at the directions. Look at look at the picture. I can't lie. Okay. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> he thinks I'm lying. <laughs> yeah, that goes oh. down. Yeah. Yeah, right. Now we're gonna get. Now you no. put now. Yes, yes. Put the next one oh, on. Incorrect. It totally corrects. <laughs> Look at it. Look at the picture. It's up high because that's oh, I see creating what's the going wind. On. And then these lock into these little. Yes. 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 Oh yeah! Look at that. Now is it looking like the picture? And then this piece goes on the top. Yeah, so those lock in there. Mm -hmm. There's a little tab. Okay, and then this is... That's where, just there where you put for... Your wood. Where you put the wood, yeah. Put the so wood. put the next piece on. And then this is your On the cap. top, yeah. The... He followed the instructions. Uh, he didn't believe me. Yeah, barely. He didn't believe me. I would have... You didn't have faith? You didn't have faith in me, did you? Well, in the end, I did. Ah! Oh! <laughs> so here's a nice bag for the fire pit. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. For this, it this folds down and it goes into there, and then it goes into the bag. The lighting of the new fire pit. It's the Turbo Fire Pit. She's a ripper. <laughs> Look at that turbo fire pit. Woo! No embers. No, it's very nice. And then it has these holes on the bottom to fan it, to give it air. So it just gives this beautiful, clean, hot fire. Gorgeous. It's an awesome fire pit. I love it. It's a nice clean fire, like clean hot smoke. It's being fed oxygen through these holes in the bottom. And just look at the way 
it burns really hot efficiently and clean you can see the flames coming out the holes in the top hey Alexander from the bottom yeah. look at that how it it's very efficient it's a, just a very unique design and super efficient the way it burns so it's giving us the perfect heat on the outside we've noticed not a lot of embers are coming out of it and landing on the ground around we are not getting smoked out because the smoke is going straight up yeah, I mean the design is really good the design way. yeah the design is really excellent we really like the design on this turbo fireside this is an amazing fire pit and another thing that's nice about it is you're not going to smell like smoke thank you for sponsoring the ninth element channel if you'd like to get your hands on one of these amazing fire pits there'll be links in the descriptions below thanks for watching that again you guys rub your hands <laughs> it's so cold here it's only 82 now <laughs>
Yeah, we're having uh, <laughs> venison, buffalo burger, wild mushrooms, and veggies. And With he, a little he, bit of He rains. caught and cooked the mushrooms. Yes. <laughs> Butter bow leaks from uh, McLeod. I'm going to find out the water temperature. This time, so it's gone up five degrees since a month ago when I was here. That's with not shabby. The day after Baby Ember's birthday. Not bad at all. Sixty-six kids. It's still like swimming in a glass of ice water. Okay, so I've got a I've got a question for all of you, um, and I'd be curious to know because uh, you've never met me in person, but you know me here through YouTube. I'm here at the lake. Let me flip the camera. Those are my new friends right out there on that boat. Awesome people. Um, chatting with them and showing them the camper. Alexander's here having some watermelon. And anyways, they're like, we want to go on the boat. They don't want to take their dogs. So <laughs> he gives me the keys to his brand new truck. <laughs> here. <laughs> I mean, this is a brand new electric and truck. It's awesome. Thing. Well, it's yeah. <laughs> so we've got um, Wallace is there. And oh my goodness, I forget the name of the one inside I don't the truck. Know either. Anyways, <laughs> Alexander and I are van lifers. We don't have pets. And we're now dog sitting. We're dog sitters. <laughs> <laughs> so if if you were if this was you, would you just trust me to babysit your dog? Leave me a comment below because I'm curious. Um, you know I love the four leggeds, but I don't have a dog or a cat, so would you trust me? This is funny. But so far, so good. As long as they don't wander up. Let's go meet Wallace. Wallace is just a lover. Hey, Wallace, my sweetheart. Yeah, are you keeping in the shade? He does have a dog bed under the tent over here. But yeah, this is Wallace. Hey, aren't you a sweetheart? And then we have another one in the car that um, is kind of nervous pupper. So, and the car is uh, electric and there's air conditioning going right now, so it's climate controlled in there. And I'm, oh, and he gave me the keys to the truck, so <laughs> if I need to do anything that I don't even... Silent, you it <laughs> I don't even know. Dude, he hands me this key fob, and I'm like, how does this key fob even work? Like, it's so space age, but super cool. Anyway, super... I'm just grateful that they all trust me. Okay, leave me a comment. Ah, this is the Honda Element tiny camper cabin today <laughs> now just after one o'clock let's do a check-in we've got Alexander shares the wild right here we're still puppy sitting and um, it's been a while hasn't it it's been a while but Alexander we put the awning up so now we have shade we're seeing how this is gonna work he put the stakes in the ground they weren't super easy to put in the ground those are new I'll talk about them later after I've tried them for a while but so far so far they seem to be working. Um, we're drinking a tropical beverage and uh, I'm gonna go for a swim again soon. What about you? Are you gonna go for a swim? I might do a little, yeah, I'll jump in. Yay! Well, shoot, I was just sitting talking with Alexander, asking him, how long are we dog sitting for? They told me a few minutes and he said, no, it's two hours. It's been over an hour now, which is okay, because we're here. But I wanted to take Alexander out to this island out here, like right here, right there. And you know, there's a little way to walk to it and swim to it, but I have to stay here and watch the dogs. So I'm. I'm going to make vegan Saganaki. I don't know if this is going to work, but I'm going to try it. Okay, so I'm making vegan Saganaki. So this is Mediterranean style vegan cheese by by Violife. And I'm frying it in this pan. And let's just see if I can 
flip it. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, yeah, it's kind of doing okay. We'll see if it's any good. I mean, it's okay. Puppers are... There's the one right there. He's still good, you know. In a beautiful place. You know, Ninth Element Kitchen Lakeside. This is my lake house. Ooh, the sand is hot. Okay, I'll get back to you and see, and, and I'll show you the finished result. I mean, anything that says grill me, I'm in. You know, saute me. Yeah. Oh my goodness, this is actually working. Like, it tastes just like Saiganaki. From a Greek restaurant. Okay. <laughs> Ninth Elements Mediterranean <laughs> restaurant coming to you from Crescent Lake, Oregon. Okay, so these guys just rescued this snowmobile out of the lake. So apparently people try to drive it as far as they can. Like, and they try to actually cross the lake. Right. And now they're just trying to get it the rest of the way out of the water. Yeah, they almost got it all the way out. It's an Arctic cat. So yeah, oh my goodness. Okay, they got it all the way out of the water. I do not know what they're going to do with it now. Oh my goodness. Snow cat. Just another day at the beach. You know, we pull snowmobiles. Snowmobiles out of the water. Well, it's a sad day. And Alexander, I've been hanging with the Filipino and... Oh yeah. At Busland, and today is the day we're leaving. Okay, but the final, this is your last film at Busland. My last film at Busland, I know. Wow. Last film at Busland, but they're not going to see this world. Mommy's doing the door. Let's see what we think. Blue. Oh, it's. I gotta, I gotta hug you, sweaty Sweaty mommy. Mm. Oh. Good luck at the new house. Thank you. I'm Can't excited. wait to see you when we yeah. get back. Or fall. when you get back. Yeah. Okay. Have a good summer. You too. Have a great time. All right, so this chapter is over. This bus land, it's over. Like you got to see it. Which Beautiful bus see. land. I'm happy that you got to see it. Yes. And uh, we've had two years of nonstop fun here, and the kids have grown their family, their wealth, and their knowledge. And it's bittersweet. It's bittersweet to see it all go. Yeah. But um, I'm really happy for the next adventure. Alexander's traveling east, I'm traveling north, and you'll be able to see our adventures on our channel. So, thanks for watching, everyone. Mm, bye. Bye bye. Well, good morning, cats and kittens, and feral souls, and my YouTube darlings. The day has arrived. Not Christmas, but. Our Honda Element meetup. Let me just flip you around here. Okay. There is a life I lead in this city. Hurry in to cut my teeth. I can take what I need to get by. It doesn't make it easy. The other piece of my heart is so good. Somewhere in the great unknown. When I return from the afterglow. Will you carry me like I am whole again? Wait, oh, put me together, take me back where I've been. Wow. I want it all. I had a feeling, but the feeling is all gone. Wait, hold on, put me together, take me back where I've been. Gone.